Hello and welcome to Top 10. The animal world is simply amazing. Animals have abilities that humans can't even think of doing. Imagine if you could regrow your cut-off arms or legs, or shoot electricity from your body, wouldn't that be awesome? Today, we're looking at 10 super abilities found only in animals, things that humans can't do. If you have just one of these 10 abilities, you're like a superhero. So, stick around till the end of this really cool video. Come along on this adventure, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting stuff like this. Let's get started. Number 1 is Echolocation. Echolocation is like nature's sonar system. Animals like bats emit high-pitched sounds that bounce off objects, and they listen to the echoes that bounce back to them. This helps them create a mental map of their surroundings and locate prey in complete darkness. Dolphins also use echolocation to navigate and communicate underwater. For example, Bats emit sound waves to find insects in the dark, and dolphins use echolocation clicks to find fish and move around underwater. Some birds, like oilbirds, even use clicks for navigating at night. Number 2 is Regeneration. Certain animals have the incredible ability to regenerate lost body parts. For instance, starfish can regrow entire limbs, and certain species of salamanders can regenerate not only limbs but also parts of their hearts, spinal cords, and eyes. This ability is helpful for self-repair and adapting to varying environments. For example, starfish can regrow their arms if they're damaged. Some lizards, like geckos, can regenerate their tails if they're broken off. Axolotls, aquatic creatures, can regrow entire limbs and even parts of their spinal cord. Number 3 is Magnetoreception. Migratory birds, such as homing pigeons, can sense the Earth's magnetic field lines and use them as a navigational aid during long migrations. Sea turtles also use magnetoreception to find their way across vast oceans. This ability helps them navigate accurately over long distances. For example, homing pigeons use Earth's magnetic field to find their way back home. Sea turtles sense magnetic cues to migrate thousands of miles between feeding and nesting sites. Even certain fish species rely on magnetic fields for navigation during migration. Number 4 is Thermal Vision. Snakes like pit vipers have specialized pits on their faces that can detect infrared radiation. This allows them to see the heat emitted by their prey, even in complete darkness. Some insects, like certain species of moths, can also detect infrared radiation. Thermal vision helps these animals detect temperature variations and locate prey. For example, Pit vipers use thermal vision to locate warm-blooded prey like rodents. Certain moths sense the warmth of flowers to find nectar sources. Some beetles, like certain ground beetles, detect temperature changes to locate potential mates or prey. Number 5 is hibernation. Animals like bears and ground squirrels enter a state of hibernation during the winter months. Their metabolic rate drops significantly and they survive on stored fat until spring arrives. This adaptation helps them conserve energy and endure harsh conditions. Hibernation helps animals survive when food is scarce and conditions are unfavorable. For example, bears hibernate to save energy during the winter when food is scarce. Ground squirrels go into hibernation to survive cold temperatures and limited food availability. Even hedgehogs hibernate to avoid harsh winter conditions and low food availability. Number 6 is Electroreception. Sharks have specialized organs called ampullae of Lorenzini that can detect electrical signals produced by the movements of other animals. This helps them locate prey even when it's hidden in sand or other obstacles. Electroreception assists these animals in hunting and finding prey. For example, 
sharks detect the electrical signals of injured fish to find prey. Electric fish use electroreception to navigate and communicate in murky waters. Even platypuses use electroreception to locate prey while hunting underwater. Number 7 is super hearing. Bats emit ultrasonic calls that bounce off objects and return as echoes. By analyzing the echoes, bats can accurately pinpoint the location, size, and texture of objects in their environment. Certain moths have evolved ears that can hear these ultrasonic calls, allowing them to evade bats. Super hearing helps these animals hunt, communicate, and avoid predators. For example, Bats use super hearing to catch insects mid-flight. Certain moths can hear the ultrasonic calls of bats and take evasive action. Some owls have super hearing to locate small mammals in the dark. Number 8 is UV vision. Birds like hummingbirds have ultraviolet sensitive vision, which enables them to see patterns on flowers that are invisible to humans. This helps them locate nectar and identify suitable feeding sources. Some insects also use UV vision to detect UV patterns on flowers and identify mates. UV vision assists these animals in finding food, recognizing mates, and enhancing communication. For example, hummingbirds use UV vision to spot nectar guides on flowers. Certain butterflies use UV vision to identify potential mates. Bees use UV vision to find nectar-rich flowers. Number 9 is pressure tolerance. Deep sea creatures, such as the giant squid, have adaptations that allow them to withstand the immense pressure of the ocean's depths. Their bodies are built with specialized structures that prevent collapse under extreme pressure. Pressure tolerance helps these animals survive in the extreme conditions of the deep sea. For example, giant squid have specialized tissues that help them handle deep sea pressures. Deep sea fish have flexible bodies and other adaptations to withstand pressure. Even deep sea creatures like the abyssal sea cucumber have a gelatinous body structure to handle pressure. Number 10 is flight. Birds, such as eagles and hummingbirds, have evolved the ability to fly, giving them access to various food sources and allowing them to escape predators. Bats are the only mammals capable of sustained flight, and insects like butterflies and dragonflies also fly using specialized wing structures. Flight provides these. Thanks for tuning into Top 10. We hope you enjoyed this countdown and learned something new. If you did, be sure to give us a like and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to check back next time for another Top 10 list. Until then, see you later.